So since the first item on our agenda is the recitation of the Quran, we'll go ahead and start with that first. And Brother Habib, would you like to come up and... Yes. Haida? So, brother, do I have the names? Yes, I'll give you the So, uh, everyone supposed to say three surahs, three short surahs, and I to be the uh, to be in the first place. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. ولا أنتم عبدون ما عبد لكم دين الكفر ولا أنتم عبدون ما عبد ولا أنا بتم ما أنتم لكم دينكم وليد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ألم ترى كيف فعل ربك بأصحاب الفيل ألم يجعل كيدهم في تبديل وأرسل عليهم تيرا أبابيل تمينهم بهجارة من سجيل فجعلهم كعصف مأكول بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والفجر وليال العشر والشفر والشفر والوتر والليل إذا يصر هل في ذلك قسم الذي حجر ألم تر كيف فعل ربك بعاد إرم ذات العماد التي لم يخلق مثلها في البلاد وثمود الذين جابوا الصخر بالواد وفرعون ذا الأوتاد الذين تغوا في البلاد فأكثروا فيها الفساد فصب عليهم ربك صوت عذاب إن ربك لبالمرصاد فأما الإنسان إذا ما بتلاه ربه فأكرمه ونعمه فيقول ربي أكرمه وأما إذا ما بتلاه فقدر عليه رزقه فيقول ربي أهانا كلا بل لا تكرمون اليتيم ولا تحاطون على طعام المسكين وتأكلون تراثا أكلا نما وتحبون المال حبا جما كلا إذا دكة دكا دكا وجاء ربك والملك صفا صفا وجيء يومئذ بجهنم يومئذ يتذكر الإنسان إذا إنسان وإن ذكر يقول يا ليتني قدمت لحياتي فيوم إذا يعذب عذابه أحد ولا يذيق وثاقه أحد يا أيتها نفس اليثمة مطمطة ارجعي إلى ربك راضية مرضية فادخلي في عبادي وادخلي جنتي Three surahs I'm going to plan to read are Surah Al-Qadr Surah Al-Surah Al-Nas and Surah al Surah Al-Falaq. <laughs> 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 
بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل اعوذ برب الناس ملك الناس اله الناس من شر الوسواس الخناس الذي يوسوس في صدور الناس من الجنة والناس بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم تبت يدا بلهب وتا ما اغنى عنهما لهم ما كسب سيس لنا رن ذات اللحر ومرت عمالة الحطب في جيدها هبل من مسل بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الله لا إله إلا هو الحي القيوم لا تأخذه السنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض مالك القدوس العزيز الحكيم من ذا الذي يشفع من ذا الذي يشفع إلا بإذنه يعني بين أيديهم وما خلفه ولا يهيدون بشيء من أمه إلا بما شاء وسع كرسي السماوات والأرض ولا يدوه حفظهما وهو علي الذين والسماء وما بناها والأرض وما طحاها ونفس وما سواها فألهمها فجورها وتقواها قد أفلح من زكاها وقد خاب من دساها كذبت تموت بطهواها إذ بعد أشقاها فقال لهم رسول الله ناقة الله وسقياها فكذبوه فعقروها فدمدم عليهم ربهم بذنبهم فسواها ولا يخاف عقباها اللهم صل على سبح اسم ربك الاعلى الذي خلق فسوى والذي قدر فهدى والذي اخرج المرعى فجعله غثاء أحوى سنقرأك فلا تنسى إلا ما شاء الله إنه يعلم الجهر وما يخفى من يسرك الجسر فذكر إن نفعت الذكرى سيذكر من سيذكر من يخشى ويتجنبها الأشقى الذي يصل النار الكبرى ثم لا يموت فيها ولا يحيا قد أفلح, قد أفلح من تزكى وذكر اسم ربه فصلى بل تؤثرون الحياة الدنيا والآخرة خيرا وأبقى إن هذا لفي الصحف الأولى صحف إبراهيم وموسى بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إذا جاء بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ألهاكم التكافل حتى زوتم المقابل كلا سوف تعلمون ثم كلا سوف تعلمون كلا لو تعلمون علم اليقين لترونها الجحيم ثم لترونها عين اليقين ثم لتسألنها يومئذ عن النعيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والدين والزيتون حطور سينين وهذا البلد الأمين
لقد خلقنا الانسان في احسن تقويم ثم رددناه اسفل سافلين الا الذين امنوا وعملوا الصالحات فلهم اجر غير ممنون وما يكذبك بعد بالدين اليس الله بيحكم الحاكمين بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إنا أنزلناه في ليلة القدر وما أدراك ما ليلة القدر ليلة القدر خير من ألف شهر تنزل الملائكة والروح فيها بإذن ربهم من كل أمر سلام هي حتى مطلع الفجر بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والأنصار إن الإنسان لفي خسر إلا الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات خطوة صدقة وخطوة صدقة بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل أعوذ برب الصلاة من شر ما خلق ومن شر فاسق إذا أوكل ومن شر فساس في الأبد ومن شر فاسق إذا فساس بسم <laughs> وهو ما في السماوات وما في الأرض من ذا الذي يشعر له إلا بإذنه يعلم ما بين أيديهم وما خلفهم ولا يبيتون بشيء من إذنه إلا بما شاء وسيا كرسي في السماوات وما في الأرض لقد خلقنا الإنسان في أحسن التقويم ثم رددنا ثم رددنا إلا الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات فما يكذبك بعد الدين أليس الله بأحكم الحكيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم لا في كوريش لا في مرحة الشتاء والسيف فليعبدوا رب هذا البيت الذي أطعمه من جوع ومن خوف بسم الرحيم إن أنزلناه في ليلة القدر وما أدراك ما ليلة القدر ليلة القدر خير من ألف شهر تنزل الملائكة وروحي فيها بإذن ربه من كل أمر سلام هي حتى مطلع الفجر بسم الرحيم آم الله لا إله الله لا إله إلا هو الحي القيوم لا تأخذه السنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض من ذا الذي من ذا الذي يشفع عنده إلا بإذنه يعلم ما بين أيديهم وما خلفهم ولا يحيطون ولا يحيطون بشيء من علمه إلا بما شاء وسع كرسية السماوات والأرض ولا يأوده حفظهما وهو العلي العظيم وهو العلي العظيم أدر سورة الناس and one through five آية of ياسين بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إِنَّا أَنْزَلَّاهُ فِي لَيْلَةِ الْقَدْرِ وَمَا أَدْرَاكَ مَا فِي لَيْلَةِ الْقَدْرِ لَيْلَةِ الْقَدْرُ خَيْرٌ مِنْ أَلْفِ الشَّهْرِ تَنَزَّلُ مَلَائِكَةُ وَالْرُوحُ فِيهَا بِإِذْنِ رَبِّهِ مِنْ كُلِّ أَمْرٍ سَلَامٌ هِيَّ حَتَّى مَثْلَ الْفَجْرِ سرق الله الألي الأسيم اللهم صل على محمد نعم سورة إس سورة النسر إذا جاء نصر الله والفتح 
ورأيت الناس يدخلون في دين الله أفواجا فسبح بحمد ربك واستغفر إنه كان تأوابا سلام الله العلي العظيم Next is Surah Al-Yasin between 1 through 5 ayah. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Yasin wal-Qur'an al-Hakim Innaka na min al-Mursaleem Ala siratan mustaqim تنزيل العزيز الرحيم سرق الله العلي العزيم اللهم صل على محمد وعلى محمد reciting سورة المسد and سورة الناس and سورة الفلق بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم تبت يدا أبي لهب وتب ما أغنى عنه ماله وما كسب سيصلى نارا ذات لهب وامرأته حمالة الحطب في جيدها حبل من مسد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل أعوذ برب الفلق من شر ما خلق ومن شر غاسق إذا وقب ومن شر نفاثات في العقد ومن شر حاسد إذا حسد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل أعوذ برب الناس ملك الناس إله الناس من شر الوسواس الخناس الذي يوسوس في صدور الناس من الجنة والناس بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الله لا إله إلا هو الحي القيوم لا تأخذه سنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض من ذا الذي يشفع عنده ولا بإذنه يعلم ما بين أيديهم وما خلفهم ولا يحيطون بشيء من علمي إلا بما شاء وسع كرسيه السماوات والأرض ولا يؤده حفظهما وهو العلي العظيم صلى الله عليه وسلم اللهم صل على محمد وعلى محمد سورة الأنبياء سورة الأسر سورة القادر وسورة الكافر أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والأرسل إن الإنسان لفي خسر إن الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات وتواصلوا بالحق وتواصلوا بالصبر بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إن آتيناك الكوثر وصل ريفك وانهر إن شانئك هو الأكثر بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل قل يا أيها الكافرون لا أعبد ما تعبدون ولا أنتم عابدون ما أعبد ولا أنا عابد ما أعبد ولا أنتم عابدون ما أعبد لكم دينكم ولي الدين أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الله لا إله إلا هو الحي القيوم لا تأخذ سنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض من الذي يشفع عنده إلا بإذنه يعلم ما بين أيديهم وما خلفهم ولا يهدون بشيء من علمه إلا بما شاء وأسيا الكرسي والسماوات والأرض ولا يؤد حفظهما وهو العلي الرحيم والعلي العظيم والعلي العظيم لا إكراه في الدين 
قالتها بين رشته من الغيب فما يكفر بالتاغوت ويرمن بالله فقال استمسك لا لا أن في السماء لها والعروة الوثقى لا لا أن في السماء لها وهو العزيز والله سميع عليم والله سميع عليم الله هو الذين آمنوا يخرجونهم من الظلمات إلى النور والذين كفروا أضياءهم تغوت يخرجونهم من النور إلى الظلمات أولئك أصحاب النار هم فيها خالدون سبحان الله I know it's getting a little bit late, but um, just little things I wanted to say. So, when I first came to Arizona, the very first thing that I looked for was a community and a Sunday school. Because I believed and I still believe in the power and strength of our communities. Many of our children spend close to 40 hours a week immersed in their school environment. And that doesn't count immersion or their, their exposure to TV, to their cell phones, to video games, right? And I realize it may be naive to suppose that three hours a week could tackle that level of assimilation, but it is a necessary start. Our Sunday school is a place where our youth can feel connected and they feel safe. It's a loving environment with gentle expectations. Before I ever even understood anything about Islam, I fell in love with the Aloe Bait. I loved their integrity, their strength. I loved their faith and their sacrifice. It all touched my heart. And I just knew that I wanted to be close to them. I wanted to go where they went. I wanted to do what they did, and that love that I had for them was what bonded me to Allah. And that's what I want to inspire in our youth, in our Sunday school, that type of love for the Alobait. In assembly this year, we talked about a few major themes. One of them was gratitude. All of you might remember, yeah? To recognize and be thankful for the gift that each new moment is and the opportunity that each new moment gives us. Each new moment is a new beginning and a new opportunity to do the best that we can. Second, preparation. To recognize the most important goal. The most important goal. And then take the best steps to achieve it. And if we want to arrive at any destination, we don't want to get lost along the way. We have to follow the directions, right? Or we can follow someone who is following the directions and make sure that we get where we, where we need to go. And the third item we talked about in our assemblies was worship. Our expression of submission and how we tame our nafs, ourselves, being patient in our submission to our Creator, to Allah, and understanding that every action with pure intention for Allah's, for Allah's pleasure transforms into an act of worship. We're honored and grateful and blessed to have Maulana Hussein Walji with us as our guest speaker. Milana Walji is such a loved, respected, and integral member of our community that there is no need to introduce him. And from all of us at IFAS, I extend an enormous thank you and for honoring us in our community by your presence at this celebration. Please recite a loud salwat.
This brother is always the first one to open the school. He welcomes each and every student and he's the first smiling face I usually see when I walk in a little bit late. His punctuality is something we can all learn from. He teaches Quran to our youngest, adorable group. He nurtures their understanding, loves them genuinely, and always thinks of new ways to reach any one of them when they don't get it. This brother devotes his time every Sunday to care for these little ones, ensuring they master the beginning level of Quran. He informs parents of the lesson taught in class so the lesson learned can be reinforced at home as well. A teacher is known for the lives they touch, and he has made a difference in every single one of our students' hearts. May Allah bless his efforts, Brother Zaman. Please recite a loud So this brother teaches Quran and Islamic studies to the very advanced level. His ardent devotion can be seen on his face. He helps and encourages his students to recite Quran with the best pronunciation. He requires his students to memorize surahs and follows up with them weekly. He sets clear goals and expects his students to excel. As you've seen in the Quran competition, his students have learned a lot. May Allah bless him for providing his students with the skills they need to read our Holy Quran. His knowledge and experience is a great treasure for our school. Some of you may have heard him recite Quran so beautifully. He treats all his students with love and care, and all his efforts are greatly appreciated. Brother Labib. This sister is such a sweet and loving soul. She teaches our very young little angels. Her smile makes each and every one feel special and loved. She is amazingly creative in delivering the lessons. The kids have fun and enjoy so much that they don't realize they are learning. We recognize that these little ones require a lot of patience and care. We recognize how challenging it can be to keep them engaged and interested. But she treats them all with such extreme love, care, and patience that we truly and sincerely appreciate and admire all of her efforts and the time that she has contributed in supporting the school. May Allah bless her efforts, Sister Faiza. Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad. This brother is such an easygoing and happy person. He is always ready to share a bright smile. He teaches Quran and Islamic studies to the intermediate advanced level, taking great care that they pronounce each word correctly. You heard some of his students recite during the Quran competition. His students love him due to his patience, care, and enthusiasm. We are extremely blessed to have him as part of our Sunday school. May Allah bless your efforts, Brother Ubaid. This young brother is our basketball coach and the kid's all-time favorite. Every single one of our students looks forward to seeing him. This brother makes sure that all who would like to play are included and that they have a great time. Everyone knows the value of a good referee. Sports can get vicious without one. He has a wonderful sense of humor. He's respectful, caring, and kind. May Allah bless the efforts of Brother Ali Reza. He's a He's This brother teaches Quran recitation to our middle age group. He connects and folds related points and suggestions regarding our Holy Prophet. And the al into his lessons. He ensures that the students have a complete understanding of Tajweed rules. Even more than being a great teacher, he is a guide and a support for all ages. I know my son asks him a ton of questions, and he does that because he trusts this brother's incredible knowledge of Islam. 
This brother takes the time and the effort to help all of us perfect our prayers and our wudu, giving us valuable tips and guidance before and after our prayers. I could go on forever, mentioning his significance to all of us at Ifaz, but right now he's um, visiting Iraq, and inshallah, he's remembering all of us in his doa there. May Allah bless the efforts of our brother Abu Haider. Yes, there's just a brief, uh, uh, brief, 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 uh, we also recognize, want to recognize uh, Sister Mariam, who has been an amazing force behind this school. She is a, is a pivotal member of this team, and her dedication and her commitment is, is, uh, is amazing to watch. Even today, she took on the responsibility of emceeing, although today is a day for us, the community, to thank all the teachers and the students. Even then, today, she took on the responsibility of emceeing. The program. Uh, she is. She teaches, as you all know, the intermediate Islamic studies class. Mashallah, her her way of teaching is is very creative. We have seen uh, the outcome of her work. So it's not just lectures. She she uh, intertwines work with uh, lectures with projects, and we have seen some of the projects that the children have done in terms of posters, in terms of crafts that they have created. So mashallah, she's very creative uh, individual and, and the students are really benefiting from her uh, and to further enhance her knowledge uh, she took time out uh, from her personal time to go to Canada for an extensive uh, Islamic school teacher training program and Alhamdulillah she is trained now mashallah in that program and that will allow us and her uh, to take uh, the next school year of IFAZ even even further ahead with the, with the new curriculum that she has learned and Alhamdulillah she has she is now uh, she can teach other teachers so she is a teacher of teachers and inshallah for school year 2018 2019 she will be uh, will be introducing the new new curriculum that she has learned and we have further training uh, that will happen during the month of Ramadan so more teachers are prepared for the with the new curriculum. Uh, so with that, we'd like to uh, appreciate uh, Sister Maryam uh, with a loud salawat ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so just a few more left, you guys. I know you guys want to go play. I, I would like to recognize a few wonderful sisters who have given their time to help out at school this year. May Allah bless the efforts of Sister Safa, Sister Adra, and Sister Malika. So, just one more thing. I know um, you guys are anxious to get outside to your activities, but I can't leave out the two most important members of our Sunday school team. I know you all know them well. I can't even begin to describe the extraordinary, positive, driving force of Brother Sadiq and Sister Patul. I'm certain the school would not exist without these two amazing people. Brother Sadiq is always looking for how we can improve and build our school. It's quite difficult with irregular student attendance and having a volunteer staff that occasionally cannot come. But he keeps pulling us all forward. He has a vision for this school and what it can give our youth and our community. Because of his efforts, we plan to start an amazing new curriculum next year. You heard about it. And if I ever have a question or a need, I first look to Sister Batul. I can't even begin to list all that she does because I'm sure if I did, the kids here would mute me. They've, seen, they've been so patiently waiting. 
May Allah bless your efforts, Brother Sadak and Sister Batul. A loud salwat, please, for them. So now for our students. Our students come here every Sunday to learn and spend time with their community and friends. I think they will all agree that our community center is something to be grateful for. That here they can prepare themselves for the best worship. We love all of our precious students for their efforts and their wonderful recitations in the Quran competition and the efforts of Brother Labib and Brother Obeid in preparing them. Please recite a loud salawat. I think so. After we listen, after we listen to all of you, all the beautiful recitation, uh, we're gonna pick the best, of course. So, we uh, me and Maulana, and we found out the first winner will be brother Abul Hassan. Second winner is Ali, Ali Jambay. Third winner is Dima. Um, um, the rest, of course, there will be like some is better than the other, but the rest we're gonna call you, we're gonna get two prizes too. So we're gonna start with Haida. Then yeah. They did not win the first. Uh, I mean, uh, I would love you to see you next time during the month of Ramadan. We're gonna, we're gonna do a deep competition and longer one. So this is your biggest opportunity to be the first one. Sallu ala Muhammad wa ali Muhammad. Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ali Muhammad. So um, everybody knows that I'm really bad with names, and so I'll do my best here, okay? Um, Sarah Jambe. Layla Jackson. Elias Mirza. Ila Adjurani. Allah, 
Yusuf Chokal. Chokal. Muhammad Salih Muhammad. Yaya Ubed. Zahra Nain. Imran Niruman. Sayyid Ahmed Udin. Muhammad Adam Jambe. Zaydan Mirza. Mehdi Jassin. Mehdi Ali. Dima Ubey. Mubeen Ajrani. Lara Choker. Asparin Nakfi. Zahra Naderi. Aliza Ali. Haider Osama. You're a hider. Abul Hasan Masin. Ali Jambe. Haider Daniel Ali. All right, all the kids can go outside and stop. No, first, is, I mean to uh, first, we have a snack for the kids. And then they can go out and like, give a mic to go. Yeah. 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 Yeah.